Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to be doing uh, the cross server, uh, the day two of it. But first of all, I'm just going to uh, show you something quickly because I've had someone on YouTube asking about um, how I had a character revive themselves. Um, so if, if you have a look in the Monument of Honor, and I think it's this the, the latest one that I unlocked, so it's King uh, Rank 2, uh, Get Revive Ability. So hero at second valid position can revive after death. So basically it's like uh, Dark Paladin's power uh, where when he dies he comes back uh, for a second time. Um, so this is exactly the same as that but it happens to whoever's in the second position on your team. Um, so if you on your front line, uh, your, your first line uh, where you'd normally have your tank kind of characters... Um, that's where um, the the positions are. Like, so if you've got someone in the very top position, uh, I mean, it might be just quicker, just to kind of show you on on this. Um, so, for instance, on this team, uh, it'd be the front row where I've got Mysterious Count and uh, Atlantia, or whatever name is Atalanta. Um, so the the second valid position there is the middle position so that would be mysterious count uh if i put my team like that the second valid position i think as far as i know is is then the character who's at the bottom on the front line so it's whoever the second character is on that front front row so even if you did it like that or you know like that kind of thing it's whoever the second character is on that line so uh just kind of keep that in mind when you set up your team and if you have Dark Paladin in your team not to put them in the second uh, position um, in your team so that they so that you actually can get the uh, the revive uh, when the person goes down because if you use it on Dark Paladin it's kind of going to be a waste because he already revives himself anyway so uh, if you're using him in your team put him in the first uh, valid position and uh put someone else in that second position so that to get that you need king rank to uh, from the nobility thing and to get this you you get the um the uh what do you call it um uh what are they called these these things up the top anyway to to level them up you get them from um it uh, even tells you at the top there, collect loot from Wolf or donations to earn a, a title. Uh, so normally when you do things in Wolf, especially when you're doing the um, the uh, boss in um, Wolf, you get some of that that gets contributed to it. Uh, so I think it's these things here, Guild Battle Devotion. So it can be obtained in Island Race to upgrade nobility. So whenever you do anything in Wolf, normally you get this. So if you do plunder or do your defense or do the bosses, you'll get some of that. Okay, so right, so what I was gonna do today anyway was do um the second day of the um cross server. And see how high I can get up on the uh, ranking. At the moment, I'm rank 104. Uh, you need to be in the top 300 to qualify for the uh, grand tournament at the end. Uh, so we've already had one day's worth. I haven't done today's one yet. I've still got my 15 uh, chances there. Uh, normally, um, by the end, I normally finish uh, in the sort of top 10 area on this but once the grand tournament's over I normally finish pretty low like about 100 and I think 41 was the last time uh, where I finished um, so basically I'm just going to do what I normally do I, t I showed it in one of my other videos I go for the free star uh, person and attack them and normally they've got quite a bit higher BR than me sometimes I can beat these people if I do then what I do is I just refresh opponents and always go for the free star opponent and the reason for that is I'll show you now is even if you lose you normally get about 130 uh, credit 
like the points, 130 of them points. Uh, that 130 points for losing is more than what I would get for winning against any of the one star people. And I think, as far as I remember last time, it's a little bit higher than beating the two star people as well. So I always just go for the, the three star people. Um, if I win, then I normally get something, I think it's about 230 or 240, something like that. Maybe even a little bit higher, but it's 200 and something anyway that you get. Um, so that's much higher than what you'd win uh, for beating any of the other people anyway, because it seems to be lower than what you get for losing. So I always use my um, 15 attempts um, against the three star people, basically. And occasionally when I've done this, I've lost, you know, played, uh, tried to challenge the same person over and over with the 15 tries. And sometimes I've lost like how I'm losing now without really getting any wins or anything. And then all of a sudden I'll get a win where I beat beat them completely. So that's like a bonus, really. Um, and I don't really go too mad with the retries, like uh, the extra chances and stuff. Um the first couple of times the cross server tournament was on, I think I didn't do any extra ones. Um, the last one I did, um, no, the second to the the second to last one I did, I got to second, and I only did um, a couple of extra chances, and that was on the final day, um, just because I I wanted to get the points so I could get the soul stones to get the six stars. Um, I can't even remember who that was for now. Um, but yeah, the last time I did it, I finished, I think, ninth or 10th, something like that. And um, what I did is I just did the two two extra chances each day that cost 50 diamonds. After you've bought two extra chances, it, it then costs um, 100, I think it is. So let's just, let's just see what happens here. It takes a bit of time for it to update at the bottom there with the uh, the ranking and stuff. But I'm hoping I can get to about the top 20 or so from today. And then there's uh, there should be one more day. Yeah, there's still tomorrow left. Um, so yesterday I did my 15 chances and bought two extra ones. And I think I was in the top 15 or so. And then I think by the end of the day, I think I dropped down a little bit. And by the way, by while the cross server's going on, the um, ultimate tournament's not on. So that's on like a break period at the moment. Normally that's like a daily um, tournament that happens. And it's been on every day since they started it last weekend. But while the cross server's on, they're only going to have one of the two on at a time so once this is finished i assume the next day the ultimate tournament will come back to being back on daily hopefully by then i can do a little bit better because I, I, I can work on my team a little bit over these few days and when it comes back on hopefully i can get a bit better than where i have been getting like 10th and 11th and stuff okay so i've done my 15 chances and that's put me it says rank 50 but i think i'm a bit higher than that because i've got 4160 so that's put me in 12th at the moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to get my two extra uh, chances. If I do try and do a third one, it will cost 100 diamonds. And like I say, I'm not I'm not going too mad buying all the extra chances and stuff anyway. There's, there's not really too much point. Because I, I'm kind of finishing quite high anyway. I was kind of tempted that time when I did finish second to keep going with the chances because I had quite a few diamonds at the time and just try and get first. But um, I don't know. Like I, I kind of thought to myself, well, I always kind of seem to finish quite high anyway. Eventually, I'll probably one time finish first or something anyway. So it's not not that big of a deal to me, really. Okay, so we got from that, we've got 4,420. And that should put me... 4,420. So that should put me seventh at the moment. Uh, probably by the end of the day, I think there's probably a few people in this top 50 or so that haven't done their chances today. 
Um, but then saying that quite a lot of these were on 2000 something yesterday. So they might have, might have, or they might be in the process of doing them anyway. But as long as I'm kind of in the top 20 to 30 for tomorrow, then I should get like top 10 again tomorrow just by doing uh, the two extra chances anyway. Um, obviously, some of these people, like the person at the moment, Black Dragon, has probably been using quite a lot of extra chances and stuff anyway. Um, so yeah, so at the moment should be 7th, probably by the end of the day, it'll probably be like 15th or so, maybe 20th. And then the final day, we'll see where I can finish. Uh, and then the po what you can do with them points there is you can go into uh, the points tournament shop and then buy these um, these soul stones to get uh, characters up to uh, six um, six stars. So at the moment I'm working on illusionist. So I'm hoping that by the end of tomorrow I can um, get the six star. But I don't know if I'm going to actually because I've got 955 and each set costs 1000. So I'll definitely be able to get um, another one tomorrow easily because I'm on 955 at the moment. And I think I need 180 and I'm on 110 at the moment. Uh, so that means I'm going to need quite a few more. I need to buy another uh, seven sets. So I've almost got enough for another one. So I need another six sets. So that's another 6000 points. And I'll probably get another couple of thousand at least tomorrow. So it probably won't be on this um, on this attempt of the cross server. But probably by the end of the next time it's on, I should have Illusionist up to uh, the six stars then. And then I'm pretty much pretty much done with my three teams, like getting them to six stars at the moment. Uh, I think. Blue Witch and Summoner, I've been getting a few of them from, from things like the, the uh, uh, whenever there have been events on for the uh, Soulstone exchanges and stuff. So I've got 105 of Blue Witch and Summoner, I've got uh, 55 at the moment. So they're the three characters that I can get six stars right now. Um, and then I need kind of some events or something to go on where I can get some of Bamboo Fighter, Jack Hollow, and uh, Crimson Rose, hopefully, so I can finish them off. That will get their BR up by quite a lot as well, with a thought, getting them an extra two stars. Uh, I'm nearly there with uh, Bamboo Fighter. I need another 18. I need loads of Crimson Rose, but she's too good, too good a character to leave out. And uh, Jack Hello, I'm about halfway to get the fourth star. So hopefully there'll be some events over the next month or so where I can get some of these uh, soul stones. Hopefully when it gets towards Halloween kind of time, they'll have an event on where it's Jack Hello the whole time. Um, Nap should finish him off. Um, so I'm not I'm not too too worried about that right now. Okay, so that's it, guys. Um, I hope that that helped with uh, with anyone who needed help with the cross server and uh, the nobility um, skills and buffs that you get from them. And uh, thanks for watching. Bye.